Alrighty, we are recording episode three of this Let's Play. And I know a lot of people. No, a lot of y'all are wondering, where have you been? It's been like uh, almost a month since I uploaded. As I'm attacked by two wild dogs. This game always has me doing craziness because I never really know. I, I mean, I remember playing the first game and being like, oh my god, there's some dogs in the run. So I'm so scared and terrified. And it's not even really scared, it's just like a jump scare. But I wanted to talk about maybe this game for a little bit. And why I haven't been playing that much. And one of the reasons I haven't been playing this game a whole lot is because I die a lot. So anybody that's a classic Tomb Raider player dies a lot. Because everything has to be on point. Your timing. Right here, I'm trying to remember how to enable my manual grab. But as, as it turns out, I don't need the grab at, at this point. So that's why I wouldn't be working. And you'll find out later on in the video why that makes a whole lot of sense. I still enjoy playing this. I do still enjoy this game when I do play it. I just do not play it a lot. I am working on my other YouTube series called Thicker Than Blood. Episode 1 is is up on my channel. Of course, you can click the other videos. And episode 1 is called Pain Dudes. I'm working on Episode 2. I have everything except for uh, there's one part that needs to be recorded of this episode and I'll be recording that probably next week next week as of this uploading slash recording yeah so I go on my go on the menu I'm like do I have manual grab one because I know I have manual grab one and it's, you know, kind of make the experience better for myself. <laughs> it's, that book that bear just like magically appears. So, I jumped in, I jumped in the pool because I was scared of my character dying from the bear attack. That wouldn't be, that would be hard to happen because the bears, they, they don't, it takes a little while to kill them, but not that long to where you, like, you can't kill them, or you, if you just jump around all over the place, like, crazily, like a madman. So while we are swimming underwater, I'm going to talk about these new pizza rolls that Totino's has. They're not like regular pizza rolls where you have pepperoni and triple pepperoni and cheese and you have supreme. I uh, actually, on my trip to St. Louis, found some supreme flavored pizza rolls. I really forgot how to play this game. I'm telling you, I haven't played the original Tomb Raider since it came out back in the early 90s on the PlayStation 1. And this is just like the original game. The puzzles are a little bit different because now you have that little Spider-Man looking thing. Grappling hook there. One 
Kung wala nga daw. I'll spend, like, this, this video is probably going to be about 20 minutes. Either that or I might break it up into 10 minute parts. But I do know that I spend a majority of the video dying and trying to figure out where to go. Because it's a Tomb Raider game. It doesn't tell you where to go. It's not like the new one. I've saw I've seen some Chris Smooth videos where like you can highlight stuff and it kind of sort of tells you where to go. This game does not hold your hand. You have to figure out where to go, or you're just stuck. Much like in The Legend of Zelda when you get to the Water Temple. I hate the Water Temple. I hate it with a passion. I do remember actually beating it, but I promise you if I had to play it again, I wouldn't, it, it would take me just as long to beat it this time as it did before the time I actually beat it. Because the first time I played the Water Temple, Oh, there ain't enough time. I never even beat the game. Now, my little brother beat the game with my game save, of course. No, I have not beaten. I haven't beaten any Final Fantasy game ever. I played Final Fantasy Seven. I played Final Fantasy VIII, I played Final Fantasy X, I played Final Fantasy XIII, I didn't play X-2, I didn't play XI, I played XII, I didn't beat that. None of them. But I did get the next of the round. I wish you could shoot that door. I did beat Knights of the Round. Or I got nice and around. And I think I had the Quadro Magic too. Or Quad Magic. I think it's called Quadro Magic. <laughs> I can't shoot that. Oh god, that game. But Knights of the Round with Quadro Magic is definitely beast mode. Hmm. They need to have something like that. Yes, it is, isn't it? But they need to have magic like that in, in these new Final Fantasy games. Have some quad magic. Let's see, I think I'm supposed to get up there somehow, but I don't know how I'm supposed to exactly get up there. Well, There's a way to get up there, I don't know how. But somehow, some way. <laughs> I'll be so, man, right. Like, So this rumor going around that Battlefield 4 will be oh look, we're probably in 10 minute mark. So I'm gonna cut the video or my be talking off at about 10 minutes so that you don't have to sit through 20 minutes of me trying to figure out where the hell I'm supposed to go. Right, so you all enjoy your day. Enjoy these next few seconds. And And I will talk to you all in the next video. Peace.